big story at six. Congratulations. Thank you. Republican Scott Walker sworn in for a second term as Wisconsin's governor. With his family by his side, Walker took the oath of office at the Capitol Rotunda in Madison. He then outlined his goals over the next four years with speculation he'll seek higher office. NBC 26's Holly Baker is live at 6 with more on today's inauguration. Holly. Stacy, Governor Walker took the opportunity to mention some of the highlights of his first term in office and shine some light on what his plans are for this one. The sounds of children's voices filled the air, a fitting star to Governor Walker's second term in office. The theme, Wisconsin's future, focusing on children. Our children are leading this inauguration ceremony as a reminder of our big dreams for them and for the future of this great state. He drew attention school. to the difference he sees in Wisconsin versus charter, the federal government. There is a clear contrast between Washington and Wisconsin. We have been good stewards of the taxpayers' money and lowered their tax burden as well. We've shown why the founders of this great nation looked to the states and not the federal government as the source of hope for this exceptional country. We will not let them down. Governor Walker promised changes to the size of government, lower taxes, and a transportation infrastructure, among other things, to help the economy. State agencies will be merged to make them more effective, more efficient, and more accountable to the public. We will continue to weed out waste, fraud, and abuse. Budgets will be set based on the taxpayer's ability to pay and not on the government's ability to spend. The festivities wrap up with the inaugural ball tonight in Madison. Holly Baker, NBC 26.